in this question the principle defines for us instigation that is when a person is said to instigate any other person to do a particular thing right that is a person who by willful concealment of himself or of a material fact voluntarily procures a thing to be done or an offense to be committed is said to instigate the doing of that thing and a person is considered to abet the doing of a thing when he instigates any person to do that particular thing right now let's read the facts the facts clearly provide that two religious communities lived in an area in adjacent localities a preacher x lived in that area who was known for retaining the peace and harmony in that area one day there occurred an outbreak of violence because of sudden eruption of communal hatred between the two groups between the two communities it was alleged against x that he deliberately absented himself from the area and let the right righteous mob take several lives in the area right so which of the following derivations is correct in this question the correct answer is b that is x shall not be liable for abetment of the offense of writing and murders in the area right b is the correct answer now why is the b why is b the correct answer b is the correct answer because the principle clearly states that a person is said to abet the doing of a thing when he instigates any person to do that particular thing right now from the facts we get to know that x had a very uh, reputed uh, he had he was a person of reputation in that particular area right he was a revered person by both the communities right but his absence on that particular in that community in that area on that particular unfortunate day cannot be said to be instigation or facilitation of the writers and the murderers right now if we read the whole set of facts we get to know if we read the whole set of facts we get to know that x actually had no legal duty to remain in that area and curb the outbreak of violence right that is there was no legal legal duty upon which was there upon x right what can be said is that he had a moral duty to control the situation but we cannot merely hold him liable because he had a moral duty right because there was no legal duty that was incumbent upon x to stop the let's say the communal violence or outbreak of communal violence right therefore the correct answer ultimately in this question is b that is x shall not be guilty shall not be liable for abetment of the offense of writing and murders in the area right b is the correct answer